Hey everyone, it's Ken here from Northern Viking Everyday. Today I've got a quick tutorial for you. We're going to be showing you how to pair your Keychron K3 Ultra Slim wireless mechanical keyboard with a Windows 11 PC. It's really quite simple to do. Now this keyboard can connect to up to three computers via Bluetooth. So it's really handy that way if you have a multi-computer setup. But let's go ahead, dive right into pairing this keyboard. All right, so here we are on my Windows 11 desktop. And the first thing we need to do is get into our Bluetooth settings. There's of course a few different ways to do that. We can go down to our start menu here and left click on it. And you'll probably see it here pinned in the pin section. It says settings, you could left click on that. Or you can also right click on the start menu and you should see settings right here. You can go ahead and left click on that. And that will load up your Windows 11 settings. Now over here on the left hand side, you'll see all sorts of options. And the one we're looking for is Bluetooth and devices. You can go ahead and select that. And this is where we'll be able to connect our Bluetooth keyboard. So right here, you'll see it says Bluetooth and currently mine says Bluetooth is turned off. We do need to make sure that this toggle switch is on right there. So go ahead and left click on that and it should turn blue and turn on. If your system does not have that, maybe you don't have Bluetooth in your computer, so you won't be able to connect a Bluetooth keyboard unless you buy a little dongle which adds Bluetooth to your system. I'll link my favorite dongles down below um, to help you out with that. Now from here, we can go ahead and add a device. So you can see there's a shortcut up here at the top that says add a device. You could go ahead and click on that. Or down here where it says devices, mice, keyboards, pens, etc., you can click on add a device right here. They'll both do the same thing. So we'll left click on that. It's gonna ask us what type of device we'd like to add. So we're looking for a Bluetooth device and under here you'll see keyboards listed. You can go ahead and left click on that. And then our computer is gonna start searching for our keyboard. So we're gonna to have to jump over to our keyboard now and get that into pairing mode. So over here on our Keychron K3, we need to make sure that our switches here on the top are in the correct location. So let's have a look here. We're connecting to a Windows device. So we wanna make sure that that is switched towards Windows. And then here we've got a few options. We've got off in the middle, cable to the right, and then Bluetooth off to the left here. We're doing a Bluetooth connection. So we're gonna slide that over to Bluetooth just like that. So back to the front of the keyboard here, this Keychron K3 can connect up to three computers via Bluetooth. In the corner of one, two, and three, you'll see tiny little Bluetooth logos. And that's the designation for each computer you'd be connecting it to. So one would probably be the first one you do, two would be the second one, and three would be the third. Now to get the keyboard into pairing mode, we're gonna hold down the function key right here, and then we're gonna select which one we'd like to designate. So if you're doing one, you'd hold down one. If it's two, hold down two, three, etc. So we'll hold down one because this is the first computer we're doing. We'll hold that down for about four seconds or so, just like that, the lights will go out, and you can see that one is kind of blinking here. So now we know this is in pairing mode for number one. And back over here on my Windows 11 PC, it's searching and it says keyboard input, Keychron K3. So we wanna select that when it comes up. It's gonna say connecting, give it a second here. And it says Keychron K3 connected. And now we should be able to use it here. And I've got a Google Doc loaded up and it works perfectly. And really it's that simple to pair your Keychron K3 Ultra Slim wireless mechanical keyboard with Windows 11. I hope this video helped you out. If it did, make sure to give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button. Thanks for watching and until next time, take care.